Hi, I'm Philly. Hi, I'm Tim. And, And together, together, we're high five! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey chat. Well, is Lauren here yet? She promised to come and meet me and teach me some funky dance moves. Well, gee, Case, Lauren remembered she had to go shopping. Aww. Oh, but don't worry. She left me her list of dance moves here. You can practice them till she gets back. Great. So where's this list? Oh, it's right here. Oh, thanks, Chats. Mm -hmm. Now let's have a look at this list of dance moves. Oh, that's a bit of a funny list. Bananas. Spaghetti. Oh, well, that's the list she left me, Case. Hmm. All right then, well, how about we just start with the bananas? Mm -hmm. oh, I wonder how the banana goes. I don't really know that. Oh, oh, why don't you try eating a banana, Casey? That might help. All right, here goes. Well, I guess the first thing I would do is peel the banana, like this. Oh, oh there you go. That looks like a dance move. Well, yeah, I guess it sort of does, doesn't it? Yeah. How about if I just make these moves a little bit bigger? Yeah! Woo! So let's see what's next on this list. Yep. All right. So we have spaghetti. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I wonder what sort of dance move spaghetti is. Uh, I don't really know. Well, spaghetti is pretty wiggly and wobbly. Oh, yeah, I guess it is, chat. Wiggly and 
and wobbly. Wiggle wobble, wiggle wobble. <laughs> Wiggly wobbly spaghetti. <laughs> hey, nice dance move, Case. Oh, thanks. I'm just doing the spaghetti. Cool. Where'd you learn that one? Well, it's right here on the list of moves you left me. Oh, my shopping list. That's where I left it. <laughs> Your shopping, shopping list? Yeah, I gave you the wrong list. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> well, this has some pretty cool dance moves on it, though. Oh. Yeah, like the banana. Yeah, yeah. watch this. <laughs> the banana. Oh, the banana. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and now for the spaghetti. This is a good one. Ready? Uh, the spaghetti. Oh, this one really gets you wibbling and wobbling. Wibble, wobble, wibble. <laughs> hey, guys, how about if we all dance together? Yeah! <laughs> the banana. Dancing, dancing with a brand new move. Gotta get into the Oh, what you mean? The milkshake? Oh. Yeah, oh, picking the apples. <laughs> <laughs> shopping day today and I've still got a few more aisles to go down. Oh, how can I make this shop more interesting? How about marching? Marching, marching with my trolley up and down the Big shop. Huh, me too. There's nothing I need in those aisles, but I've got two to go. Trolley marches ready, prepare to march. Marching, marching with my trolley up and down the aisles. Wheels go round on my trolley pile up. I cause today is shopping day, that's why. Prepare to stop. <gasps> huh. Whoa, I was so busy concentrating on my marching, I forgot to look at the shelves. Oh, me too. I haven't got much room left in my trolley anyway. Huh. Better march off to the register to pay. Me too. <laughs> Today, I can't decide whether I want to paint or dance. So, I've decided to do both. I'm going to use my feet and the trays of paint to make some dancing shapes. What shape can I make? What shape can I make here? A tiptoe, tiptoe kind of shape. That's what I made here. Wow! <laughs> My tiptoe dancing made lots of little toey dots and dips. Yeah. Oh, and you can see my footprint in there. Mm. It's just like my fingerprints, but on my toes. Mm. So, my tiptoe dancing made a dotty painting. I wonder what happens if I do a different type of dance. Hmm, I'm thinking something wide and wavy and swishy and swooshy. Yeah, that's it. I'll put my whole foot in the paint and then I'll swish around. Okay, but I've got to be careful when I swish around. I don't want to slip over in the slippy, slidey paint. Wow! What shape can I make? 
What shape can I make here? A swishy, slidey kind of shape. That's what I made here. Wow! This dancing shape painting is looking pretty amazing. Hmm. Oh, and by swishing around, I've made lots of long streaks. So now my little tiptoe dips and dots have long streaks all around them. How cool is that? So I made little tiny dancing shapes with my little tippy toes, and I made long streaky swishy shapes with my whole foot. You know there must be another type of shape I can make. Let's see、um, some skipping shapes or jumping shapes, or what about? Stamping shapes. Yeah, I'm gonna make some stamping shapes with my feet. Yeah. What shape can I make? What shape can I make here? A stumpy, stampy kind of shape. That's what I made here. Wow. Tiptoes, swishes, and stumps. They all make a really cool dance shape painting. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. But I might need some help getting off my painting now. Tim, Casey, help! I hope they come soon. Making music using different parts of my body. Fingers first. Click, 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 click. I wonder what else I could use. I know. Clapping hands. How about slapping thighs? Oh, and stomping feet. <laughs> I can also make a talking sound. And I just thought of one very silly sound I can make: <gasps> blowing raspberries. Let's put them all together from the top. <laughs> My body makes music. Click, 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 click. My body makes music. Clap, 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 clap. My body makes music. Slap, 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 slap. Stomp, stomp, talk. Tim's Tap and Clap Dance School. This is where I teach people how to tap and clap. Hi, Hi tap, tap and clap, clap teacher Tim. Tim. Hi guys, are you ready for your first lesson? Sure am. We've got our tap shoes ready for tapping.、Yep. And did you bring your hands for clapping? <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> All right, guys, let's get started. <laughs> first, you tap. Then you clap, tap tap tap, clap clap clap. Tapping and a clapping is fun to do. Soon you'll tap and clap the whole day through. Yeah! <laughs> oh, gee, this tapping and clapping is a lot harder than it looks. Oh, don't worry. You'll get it. We just need to tap and clap at the same tempo. Tempo? Yeah, it means how quickly we make our taps and claps. So, a fast tempo would be, <laughs> and a slow tempo would be. There、oh. we go. <sighs> Now we just need to tap and clap at the same 
time. Are you ready to try it again? Yeah. All right, here we go. First you tap, then you clap. Tap, tap, tap. Nice. Clap, clap, clap. Tapping and a clapping is fun to do. Good. Soon you'll tap and clap the whole day through. Yeah! Well done, guys! Hey, Tap Teacher Tim, can we try that one more time? Oh, sure. I think so. But now that we're in the swing of it, let's try a faster tempo. Ooh, yeah. Good luck, Belly! Here we go. First you tap. Then you clap. Tap, tap, tap. Clap, clap, clap. Tapping and a clapping is fun to do. Soon you tap and clap the whole day through. Yeah! <laughs> Great tapping and clapping and at the perfect tempo. Yeah! <laughs> Stevie, are you up for something a little different today? Yeah, sure, I'm up for anything. How would you like to squish some bugs? Oh, squish some bugs? Yeah. I'm sorry, Tim, but I couldn't imagine squishing a poor little defenceless bug. Oh, me neither. But trust me, it's not really squishing bugs. OK, Tim, now I'm officially confused. <laughs> It'll all make sense very soon. Stevie, I think it's time for another Fitbit tip! <laughs> Stevie, my man, squishing the bug. Ah, oh, squishing the bug is a tap dance warmer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Tash here is going to show us how it's done. First, you put the heel on the ground. Now we have a bug on the floor. A squash now. Squash. Now the bug's running away. Now it's running away. So we move our foot from side to side. Are we all ready to go tap dancing? Yeah! Well, let's go. some warm-up stretches before I start dancing. I don't have anyone to dance with today, so I guess I'll be dancing solo, all by myself. Tap, tap! Did somebody say tap, tap? Hey, look! Tap shoes! I wonder how these got here. See the taps on the bottom? They make a great sound when you dance. I know what kind of dancing I'll do today. Tap dancing! Nice shoes. One. Two. Tap, dance! <laughs> tap, tap, tap. One, two, three. <gasps> Did you hear that? Was that an echo? I'll try it again. Tap, tap, tap. One, two, three. There it is again. Let's tap dance. On the stage, let's razzle dazzle. On the stage, are you ready to dance? Lights are shining down on you tonight On the stage, hear the clapping On the stage, put on a show Everyone is watching you tonight Razzle dazzle, sparkle and shine Razzle dazzle, cause it's showtime <laughs> Wow, I'm not sure who it is, but I've got one fabulous dance partner. I'm going to try tapping a different beat. Tap, 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 tap. One, two, three, four. Tap, tap! Hmm? <gasps> hey, what's this doing here? This belongs on my head to add a little extra razzle-dazzle. <laughs> tap, tap! What's that? <gasps> Look! Tails! Wow! Now I really love...
look the part. Hey, I can put on a show. Lights <laughs> and music. On the stage, let's razzle dazzle. On the stage, are you ready to dance? Lights are shining down on you tonight. On the stage, hear the clapping. On the stage, put on a show. was Lauren that was dancing. Or Tim. I must go and find out. I love ballet. Soft, floaty ballet arms and hands and ballet feet with pointed toes. Be a ballerina, could you be a ballet dancer? Get into position and perhaps you'll find the answer. Be a ballerina, making ballet feet move. And positions. Be a ballerina. Could you be a ballet dancer? Get into position and perhaps you'll find the answer. Be a ballerina. Making ballet feet move. One, two, three, four, five. Now you're in the ballet groove. <laughs> Our hidden treasure today is something that you might need for a big dance workout. It's a stripy towel, so remember to look carefully during the story and see if you can spot it. But first... Once there were two birds that just loved dancing, Swan and Flamingo. Wow, what wonderful leaping Flamingo! You get so high off the ground. Thank you, Swan. <gasps> What a wonderful pirouette. You are so good at balancing. With their long dancing legs and graceful necks, the two birds found it easy to spin and leap and turn. But then there was Elephant. First position, second position, plie, arabesque, pirouette, jeté. On toes, turn and now gracefully take your bow. You see, Elephant loved ballet more than anything, but he didn't find it easy to spin, leap, and turn. <gasps> oh, wow! I wish I could be a great dancer like Swan and Flamingo. Ooh, oh, oh, sorry. <gasps> All right, everybody. Time for class. Take positions, please. That's Miss Juliet, the ballet teacher. OK, everyone, standing beautifully. Lovely arms, long necks. Good. The dancers were about to perform in their special yearly concert and Miss Juliet wanted everything to be perfect. First position, second position. Flamingo and Swan, you have forgotten the steps. 
this is no good. You must practice some more. We have hundreds of people coming to see the concert and you are still not ready. Oh, I'm trying to remember the steps, but while making sure my jeté is perfect, I forget what comes next. And I'm concentrating so hard to be on centre that I forget which step comes next too. Whatever are we going to do? Hey guys, maybe I could help. Really? How? Well, I'm an elephant. I may not be light on my feet, but I have a seriously good memory. Come on, I'll show you. And so Elephant spent the whole afternoon helping Flamingo and Swan remember their steps. By the time of the concert, the dancers were ready. Positions, please. First position, second position, plie, arabesque. And that's how they all became a company of great dancers. Now, did you spot the stripy towel? There it is. Good work. Okay, time to step over there, guys. Yeah! <laughs>